so the final upshot is this. I am not ashamed of, I am ashamed, I guess I should say, of the position that I've fallen to. Only in the fact that I trusted too many of the wrong people. But I'm also ashamed of America, that this shit could allow, I'm ashamed for America, that we would allow this kind of vilification of a certain group. Tell me that's never happened before. <laughs> we need to stop finding the differences and start seeking the similarities. This is bullshit that we're just dividing. This is a way of the government trying to keep you from looking at it. If you keep the multitude in chaos, then they don't have time or energy to look upward. Well, stop the chaos. I, I don't, I'm not ashamed. We have to leave. We know that there are little previously busted rats running around telling the police about my whereabouts, although I don't know why I'm so special. But we feel our 15 to 20 minute allowance period in Reseda to clear out that was mandated to me by the police this morning has probably been exceeded. And so I expect at any moment they're going to pull up and arrest me for being here. Like I'm not allowed to be in Reseda anymore. Well, if the reason is because I'm such a social threat, then if I was a criminal, I'm a shitty criminal because I'm still living on the street. But I can't. I also can't be much of an addict because addictions take money. I don't have any fucking money. How am I going to afford my fucking addiction? Maybe uh, we could just leave the fucking white people with their dog and their cat alone. Because we can't take our animals somewhere else on the bus unless they are therapy animals. We have to have our dog certified that he provides some sort of function where if you pet him, you feel better. Let's be fucking real. You want me out of here? Instead of expending multiple harassments, taking all this shit, I've challenged the police a couple of times. But not just any individual. I said, all you 10 guys will fight. You you guys against me. And they didn't want to do it. So I guess I scared them. They almost shot me. Um, which I didn't think they were going to go to that extent, honestly. They're fucking psycho motherfuckers. Uh, and now I've got... My, I'm barely able to walk because I had these fucking Krispy Kreme eaters fucking putting their knees in my back when I was on the hot ground. That'll go away. Everybody that looks at me weird right now, I don't care. I, I got, I've been having these looks forever. But if I am the local villain, like they alleged that I pulled a knife on the taco business. But if I'd have done that, that's stupid. You know why? Because I buy tacos from there. And I want to be able to continue eating. So there's a bigger reason than... I'm going to pull a knife on taco ladies? Really? Like, how many notches in my gun do you think that fucking gets? That's a bullshit lie. They tell me they've called the fucking owners of properties to see whether we have permission or not. Since when do cops just randomly uh, run your paperwork and all this just to see whether you're legal? Hey, what about probable cause? What about something to fucking that we did wrong first? Before, I, before you go rousting my ass... And fucking with me and just put me through the legal mill. Make sure I did something wrong, goddammit. This is what I get for trying to clean up my life. After being sober. Oh yeah, sober. Puts the promises and all this other bullshit in your head. Honesty isn't the best policy. It's the worst policy. Because nobody else is operating with it. What happened to when in Rome? I guess I've got to pull that number just so I can continue to survive. Because now at this point it's gotten so serious. I do not want to threaten Tracy's my dog doofus or my cat shitty kitty's life anymore than they need already have had happen they're already at the breaking point and i shouldn't have put any of them through it 
This is ridiculous. I kind of knew where it was going. There's a police, LA City oppression. At what? I don't fit in the fucking schematic of things? Fuck you. Either way, I guess I gotta fucking give and pee because love is fucking weakness and integrity is a liability.